Max Dominguez Way, more than 10 sunny South Africa, and there is Table Mountain. On the right hand side, as you can see, there is the cable cars. And hi, my name is Ron Rogan Um, behind me is Sand Cog, where the penguins come to be benefited from the oil spills and all the bacteria and the cats. Is the furthest mountain at Miller's Point, and that's where all the penguin colonies are. The second mountain is the second mountain closest to us is Mill is Musenberg, where I used to surf, but I don't surf there anymore. I used to surf on the surface corner, but I don't surf there anymore because of the high surge point that flows that the flows into that place. Flows from that place. See, uh, what do you see by the foam? What do you see? Oh, yes, okay. the foam. Okay. As you can see, it is a little bit, the wind is blowing, but you can see how the foam is like the streaks are there. It's quite a high a pollutant in the water. And as you can see over there on the, on the bank, there's foam, and that's um, high in pollutants. And as well, um, you see the white foam? When the sun bakes on it, it pops. And that bleaches that greeny. So you see how it's greeny? Yeah. And Very then also nice. got the like, lime color. It also goes under green, underneath, and the top. What's, and why is it lime? What's that mean, kid? Why is it the one? Yeah. What, what is bleach to you? Oh, uh, bleach like lime. Bleaches. Well, kills bleach, it. bleach kills, kills it. it. So, it, so. so if you get, if you go to Cork Bay, right? And I was a young little kid dived in Cork Bay. I dived, I grew up basically in Cork Bay. So inside the harbor, you can go see the, the, um, the sea letters on the rocks, right? Inside it's very devoid of life. The reason being the water is very warm and you'll find there hardly any, uh, any um, fish on those rocks and the, even the periwinkles, everything is very small. And the, and the, the sea letters is bleached. If, you go, if we go dive, we come, we go out the, as we go swim out the harbor, everything you see, the sea letters, it becomes greener. You swim across the channel, and you go to Corpe and you come up the gully and you go into Corpe swimming pool, a small swimming pool, but also the um, sea letters is a little bit uh, greener, but not as, not as bleached as the one in Corpe. You jump into Corpe, um, the big swimming pool by the brass bell, it's green, 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 green. Because the reef on the outside, we used to surf there as well when the, when the southerly storms come. Beautiful to go surf there. Now all that warm, uh, all that warm water, all that oxygenated water comes over, right? And the water is a little bit deeper there in, Cor in Corpe. So it's also shaded. So the sun doesn't get to bleach, doesn't get to, it heats up the surface of the water. And you've got the continuous waves that come over, so it aerates it. So the, 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 the sea letters in uh, Corpe swimming pool, it's far greener, right? it's far healthier, you understand? Now that's about bleaching. Now Kate, talk about your, your algae that's been bleached, yeah? What, do you, what else do you see? Um, so when the algae gets bleached and the sun um, pops it, so it evaporates into the atmosphere, which depletes the ozone layer, that also affects our magnetosphere that protects us from the sun, the radiation from the sun. Um, and what's that team? Speeding up? Oh, speeding up global warming and climate change. Okay, so is this pollution good or bad? Yeah, it's bad, very yeah. bad. Have you ever it's seen? Bad. Have you ever seen this um, this uh, flamingo no. play? Um, Not as so bad. No. The foam. There's lots of foam. See yeah, the streaks. Lots of foam. See the streaks. Yeah, let's see the streaks. Yeah. Far more streaks. And there's, there's a bit of a breeze here. But look at the streaks here. There's a massive amount. But even if this was a flat, calm day, right? Mm, you still go to the water and There's like, no wind. Yeah, no wind. Make the ropes brand new and stuff like this. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Shake like this. Then the foam will. So you'll see the foam, yeah, yeah that's, foam. that's bad. Now this is flamingo play, tell me about the flamingos you see in this play. Oh yes, the flamingo play is also, um, you um, get the um, dolphin. dolphin beach and you look at the hotel. Yeah. So there's also ponds there, and you see the flamingos there, they should be pink but they're not, they're white because of the um, plankton, zooplankton. and the, the zooplankton is not um, in the mud. In the mud. So me and my dad used to go pump up prawns, so as we pump up prawns, you see the Where you pump prawns? Monitor lagoon. Yeah, oh, the pink prawn, yeah, monitor yeah. lagoon. Yeah. And then when you pump it up, it's in black the and it stinks. Yeah, so that's decomposing. Decomposing. Yes. So that means the flamingos aren't very healthy, hey? No. 
Yeah. And the flamingos, the back of this, the flamingos, yeah, the back of, of the flare, yeah, with all the sewage and all the effluents coming out, all that silt, right, all the underground water for years, right, has been contaminated. So it's all saturated with high effluents and pollutants. Yeah. So that all flows down into into the into the estuary. It's quite bad, very bad. Okay, you want to see? You want to have a look? Yeah, we see all this foam. The anti foam, eh? Look at all that bleaching taking place. Oh my heck, all those bubbles popping up. Where are they going? Into oh. the atmosphere, Steve. Yeah. yeah, speeding up climate change. And global warming. Global warming. And what's happening to the ocean? What the giant, what's happening to the ocean now? It's heating up the yeah. ocean. I mean, the, the, the oxygen, oxygen, the oxygen, the, the, ox, so the oxygen, the, the, the oxygen evaporates because of the warm water it makes the water more salty, salty right so if it's more salty what is, what is the what does the sun the gamma rays it do it. It, makes, uh, um, it's splits. Release, it, it splits it splits the salt into me, me, metallic, metallic minerals metallic and makes the water milky yeah, and what's a video footage now that you've seen uh, with a lot of video footage with underwater what color is the water green why is it green the, um, sun? the sun that's baking down onto them, there's too much minerals inside the water. Yeah, so there's way, way too much minerals in, in, the, in the ocean. So, that, so that, that's, uh, it, that's uh, what's it doing to the reefs? The acid, all that salt? It's killing it. So basically, like it's I said, it's bleaching. It's bleaching. Same as this yeah. same as this yeah. So you see yeah, it bleaches the bacteria inside the reefs. What does it do? It's killing the reefs. Globally, 90% of the reefs What's happened to them? They died. They died. So you could tell me about the splitting of the corals? Oh yeah, so like I said in my previous video, mm -hmm. like for instance, you go to the garden center and you buy your flowers. And you go plant them the next day you don't like them, so then you spray um, weed killer and they're all done. So basically what they're doing in the ocean, they're splitting the corals, they're planting it, and the next day they come with all dead. It's a death because of the sun that is um, beating down on the ocean that's too that's causing too much minerals in the water. Acid acid acid. acid. It's killing the reefs. So we're ready to go, we're gonna go look at Milton now. See all the streets here, eh? this is hectic. Eh? I've never seen this flay this bad before. I mean, it's hard, there's a bit of a side easy breeze, but I mean, you know, the, amount of, the amount of foam streaks in this water, this is astronomical. And the bank side here, yeah, yo, 